friend right here, she's single and she thinks you're really hot. Thank you. I rate you a 9 out of 10. Why not 10 out of 10? Because I'm the one she needs. Okay. <laughs> Are you a camera? No. Wait, why? Because every time I look at you, I smile. <laughs> Do you have a pencil nearby? Yeah, why? Because I want to erase your past and write our future. And that's a good one. What are your fees? I charge $50 for three questions. That's awfully steep, isn't it? Yeah, I suppose so. Now what's your final question? Do you know the difference between right and wrong? Yes, I do. Alright, if I reached into a man's pocket and took his wallet with all his money, what would I be? You'd be his wife. I'm afraid I can't let your elephant in here, sir. Oh, I assure you, he's very well behaved. All right then, you know if you say so. I'm very surprised. Your elephant you know was well behaved and he even seemed to enjoy the movie. Yeah, I was surprised too. He I hated the book. Dad, let's see how smart you are. Fine. What's the opposite of bottom? Top. What does S H O P spell? Shop. What do you do at a green light? Stop. <laughs> I finally get it. Get what? You know how when things get hot they expand? Yeah. So I'm not fat, I'm hot. Here is the only way to survive a bear attack. As soon as you see a bear you're going to want to raise your right arm as high as possible. Researchers have found that bears love to talk but they don't like talking unless you ask them first. The last time I went camping and I seen a bear I tried this method and it worked. I talked to Fred for at least two and a half hours and I asked him why they attack us. He said it's because they think we're going to attack them. So as long as you use this method, you should be good. Thank me later. Is there a problem, officer? Sir, you were speeding. Oh, okay. Can I see your license, please? I would give it to you, but I don't have one. You don't have one? I lost it a few years ago for drunk driving. I see. Can I have your vehicle registration papers, please? I can't give you those either. Why not? I stole this car. Stole it? Yeah, and I killed the owner. You what? His body's in the trunk. I need backup right now. Sir, can I get you to step out of the vehicle, please? Why? Is there a problem? One of my officers told me that you stole this car and murdered the owner. Murdered the owner? Yes. Can you please open the trunk? Yeah, of course. Hmm, I didn't find anything. Is this your car? Yeah, here are the registration papers. My officer also claims that you don't have a license. Here it is. My officer said that you didn't have a license, stole this car, and murdered the owner. I bet that liar told you I was speeding, too. My password's Luke123. What's yours? Mine is Superman, Batman, Flash, Iron Man, Deadpool, Loki, Thor, Spider-Man. Why is it so long? It had to be at least eight characters long. Hey, can you do the dishes, please? All of them? Yes, all the dishes. But all I did is put one cup in. Don't make me ask you again! Okay, okay, fine. Hey! Who are you? I'm your son. Get out of my house before I call the cops! Let me take that from you, honey. Is there anything else I can do? Can you make me a peanut butter and jelly sandwich? Coming right up. No, I should get it because I always get 100% on my tests. But I've never skipped a day of class. What are you two arguing about? We found this $20 bill and decided to give it to whoever could tell the biggest lie. You should be ashamed of yourselves. When I was your age, I didn't even know what a lie was. Ah, you win. <gasps> Can I tell you a joke about a vacuum? Yeah, sure. Never mind, it sucks too much. Why are you late this morning? It's my alarm clock. Everyone got up except for me. How did the alarm clock wake everybody else up except for you? There's eight of us in my family, but the alarm clock was only set for seven. <gasps> what should I get your brother for his birthday? I have no clue. <sighs> I have an idea. Can you go talk to your brother and try to see what he wants without making it too obvious? Sure, whatever. Happy birthday, Luke. Tickets? For what? Well, your sister heard you listening to the song called Losing It by Fisher last week, so I decided to get you two tickets to Chasing Summer in Calgary so you could go watch him perform live. Really? What is it? Tonight, so go get ready. Thank you guys so much.
picture probably confuses you, but the buildings are just made out of Lego. This tree looks like a giant broccoli. This dog looks like a bodybuilder. This lady looks like she has really thin legs, but it's just a white stripe on her pants. This dog looks like he has bad teeth, but it's actually just a toy. The angle this photo was taken makes his arm look like a leg. The view out this window is so nice, it looks like a painting. That's what you get, loser! I've been really addicted to this tennis game. It's literally the most fun multiplayer game you could get for free. Like, watch this. If you guys want to play it, click the link on my profile, then press Tennis Clash. Pack your bags, sweetheart. I won $10 million in the lottery. Wow! Now London or Switzerland? Who cares? Just pack your bags and get lost! <laughs> Mom, look what I got on my report card. Oh. You got one A minus and the rest A pluses. I thought I raised you better! You should have studied harder! Look what I got on my report card. Who are you? Your son? Oh yeah. What'd you get? I got all A pluses. Oh. Cool. Mommy, look what I got on my report card. Good job, honey. I'm so proud of you. You passed one class. Let's go for dinner to celebrate. Three weirdest restaurants in the world. Cafe Econ is a three-story restaurant. The first floor is normal, but the second and third floor are filled with ankle-deep water and swimming fish. One floor has smaller fish than the other, so you could choose which one you'd like. Guests have to take off their shoes before entering. In the restaurant called Modern Toilet, the chairs are replaced with toilets and the food is shaped like this. An example of a meal you could order is called a turd sub sandwich. This restaurant is prison themed. Guests are brought to their table by a prison guard. Each table is in a different cell blocked off by big black bars. The prison guards carry fake guns and there's also fake guns on the walls and ceiling. How did you get 2 plus 2 wrong? I don't know. You're stupid, that's how. I'd slap you, but that would be animal abuse. Are you good at physics? Can you help me? Two elephants were walking together. One was red and one was left-handed. How old is my dog if I like pancakes? Yeah, what's the question? Doctor, I'm having a tough time losing weight. What should I do? From now on, I want you to split everything you eat. So, for example, if you want a banana, just have half of it. Okay, I'll give it a try. Thanks. Welcome to the donut shop. What can I get for you? Hi, just one moment, please. So, since the doctor said to split everything, do you want to split a donut with me? I have an idea. Let's split two. <gasps> it's time to get up and get ready for school. <sighs> Mom. I don't think I can go to school today. <laughs> Just suck it up and go get ready. You're gonna make me late for work. But I really don't feel good. <laughs> uh, I'm not buying it. I'll be waiting in the car. Mom? What? I'm not feeling very good. And what do you want me to do about it? Can I stay home today? I don't care. You can walk to school, take the bus, stay in bed, whatever. Just leave me alone. <sighs> My little angel! Is everything all right? Yeah. Oh, you don't look very well. Do you want me to get you some soup? Mom, I'm fine. You know what? I'll call the school right now and let them know you won't be in for the rest of the year, okay? Did you do your chores? No, not yet. I'll do them after I finish this game. That's it. Give me your controller right now. I'm taking this for a month. Now go do your chores before I take something else away. <sighs> Gerald, did you do your chores yet? My name's Connor. I know, I haven't yet. Can I do them after I finish this show? Oh yeah, whatever. As long as they're done by the end of the day. Sweetie, did you do your chores yet? No, I'm too busy playing a game on my phone. You know what, my little angel? It's okay. I'll go do them myself because I don't want you to hurt yourself before your baseball game in four months. Don't do it. I bet you'll regret it the rest of your life. Like... You dummy, don't say yes. No, no. Dang, he finally did it. What an idiot. What are you watching? Our wedding. <laughs> he discoveries that made people rich. A collector bought a painting and when he went to fix the frame, he realized that inside was a piece of paper. But it wasn't just any piece of paper. He found a copy of the United States Declaration of Independence. He bought the painting for $4, but the piece of paper is worth almost $1 million. A man whose hobby is to use a metal detector to search for treasure got really lucky. He found a strange greenish piece with a red engraving, then a chain, and finally a Celtic treasure, which is again worth close to $1 million. As the couple was packing to move to a new house, they found an action comic book number one, dated 1938 in one of the boxes in their attic. Only 99 copies of this comic exist and each are sold for 1.5 million dollars.
Here's the dumbest things bought by billionaires. Saudi Prince Amir bought a Mercedes covered in 300,000 diamonds. It took 13 experts two weeks to attach them and it cost 4.8 million dollars. Data Fugue bought a shirt made entirely out of gold. It has over 14,000 pieces of 22 karat gold weighing 7 pounds. And it cost him $250,000. Finally, Kanye West spent just under a million dollars on four gold-plated toilets for his mansion. Sis Emily, I have a boyfriend. I found your purse at Starbucks and it had your number on it, so I thought I'd let you know. Oh my goodness, where can I meet you to pick it up? I have a girlfriend. I want to break up with you. What? Why? Because I want someone who's strong, tall, and handsome, which isn't you. You're short, skinny, and nerdy. <laughs> Excuse me, sorry to bother you. I just think you're really handsome. Can I get your phone number? No thanks. What? <laughs> Why not? Don't you remember? I missed your short, skinny, and nerdy. Yeah, yeah. Drink and dope, turn me to a superhero, yeah. This hotel sucks. Why? What's wrong? Last night, I got no sleep. Every 15 minutes, this loud banging noise woke me up. Oh, I'm so sorry. How was your guys' stay? Terrible. The guy in the room beside us was snoring so loud that we had to bang on the wall every 15 minutes to wake him up. <gasps> Look at this funny TikTok. <laughs> That was actually a good one. I thought that app was just cringe. Alright, what's this thing called? TikTok? Alright, now how do I do this? <laughs> That'll have to do. Look, it's that guy that posted that cringe TikTok. How can he even come to school after posting that? Well, my last video got a thousand views, so I'm sure I could get more. Did you hear he just hit 100,000 followers? Yeah, but he just posts cringe videos. He's not going to get any more than that. <laughs> You're right. Oh, it's Luke Davidson. He just hit 10 million followers today. 10 million? Yeah. It was just a dream. Good morning, Luke. I just wanted to congratulate you on 10 million followers. Huh? <gasps> what do you call security guards working outside Samsung shops? I'm not sure. Guardians of the Galaxy. I think you love your girlfriend a lot. Why do you say that? I hear you calling her baby, sweetie, and cutie. No, I actually forgot her name. What is your first wish? I wish I were rich. It's done. What is your second wish, rich? Son, give me your phone for a minute. Wait, Dad, let me turn it on. You know that I won't stop until I make you mine. Here you go. Thanks, I just wanted to check the time. Thank you guys so much for two million followers. And you know, since I'm like a little bit more famous now, I wanted to see if I could get myself on the celebrity lookalike app. I gotta make sure I get my best angle. What? Roger Federer. Oh, must be the smile. If you want to find out what celebrities you look like, just click this link on my profile, then click Celebrity Lookalike to download the app, and let me know in the comments who you get. Why do you look so fat? I have a baby inside me. Is it a good baby? Yes, it's a very good baby. Then why did you eat it? What is the secret of your success? Two words. And what are they? Right decisions. But how do you make right decisions? One word. And what is that? Experience. And how do you get that? Two words. And what are they? Wrong decisions. Dad, how are people born? Adam and Eve made babies, then their babies became adults and had babies and so on. Mom, how are people born? We were monkeys, then we evolved to become what we are now. You lied to me! No, your mom was talking about her side of the family. <gasps> Most respectful moments in sports. During a match, Cristiano Ronaldo broke a fan's nose from kicking the ball. But at the end of the match, he looked for the fan to check on him and also ended up giving him one of his shirts. Matthias Steiner, who was a weightlifter, was determined to win an Olympic gold medal after his wife passed away. During the 2008 Beijing Olympics, he ended up winning gold. And on the podium, he posed with a medal and a picture of his wife. During a marathon where two brothers were competing from Great Britain, one of them stopped near the end because he was too tired. His brother, who was a few meters behind him, took him by his arm and helped him cross the finish line in first place.
How much would you sell your horse for? I'd sell it to you for $2,000. 2000 Deal. Perfect. You can come and pick him up tomorrow. Hey, I'm here to pick up the horse. I have some bad news. Unfortunately, the horse passed away. <sighs> you know what, it's fine. Just give me my money back. I can't do that. I already spent it all. <sighs> okay, then give me the dead horse. Why? What are you going to do with it? I'm going to raffle it off. You can't raffle off a dead horse. Of course I can. I just won't tell anyone that it's dead. Hey man, what happened to the dead horse? Did you end up raffling it off? <laughs> I sure did. I sold 500 tickets for $25 each and made a total of 25000 Did anyone complain? Just the guy that won. So I gave him his money back. <gasps> so some of you have been calling me the CEO of Finding Games. So what did I do? I found another. Only 12% of the people that play this game have beat the first level on their first try. If you think you're part of that 12%, click the link on my profile, then press Cube Surfer Game. Try the first level, then come back and comment if you did it. Hello? Honey, it's me. Are you at the golf course? Yeah. Why? I'm at the mall. I found a leather coat. It's only $1,000. Can I get it? Sure. Go ahead if you really like it. I also stopped by the Mercedes dealership and seen one that I really liked. How much is it? 98000 Okay, but for that price, make sure it comes with all the options. Great. Oh, and one more thing. The house that I wanted last year is back on market for 980000 Well, then offer 900000 and they'll probably take it. But if not, offer an extra 50000 if you think it's a good price. Okay, I'll see you later. I love you so much. You're worth it. Bye. Does anybody know whose phone this is? Stop taking pictures of yourself. Make me. I'm sorry, but your mom already made that mistake. <gasps> I'm actually using this celebrity lookalike app, see? What? How do I get that? Just click the link on my profile. For some reason, I got the same as you. I know I'm going to die, and I want to take my money with me. So I'm going to give each of you 150000 and I want each of you to make sure the money gets into my coffin. I can't live with this guilt anymore. I only put 100000 into his coffin. I'm glad you brought that up. I've been feeling guilty too. I only put in 80000 You guys should be ashamed of yourselves for stealing money like that. Am I the only honest person here? Look, I wrote a check for the full 150000 <gasps> <gasps> okay, I'll call 911. I'm calling, but it just keeps coming up busy. Can you tell me what's going on? That's not Herb. Um, uh, Mom, it's Herb. He's sitting in the living room now. When are you coming home? You let him in? You have to do everything I say, okay? Okay. What's he doing right now? Now I want you guys to comment if I should tell her or send a picture. Based on your comments, I'll pick one and post part three tomorrow. But if you want to find out what happens right now and read a bunch more stories, just click the link on my profile and download the app. Dumbest Lottery Winners After winning $1.3 million in the California Lottery, Dennis Rossi filed for divorce from Thomas Rossi so she wouldn't have to share the money with him. Thomas decided to sue her for violating state law and he kept all the money. Michael Carroll won $14 million when he was just 19. After claiming he wouldn't spend the money on dumb things, he bought multiple luxury cars, mansions, and other expensive things. To this day, he lost all his money and works at a cookie factory. Jack Whitaker won $315 million in the US Lottery. When he claimed it, he took it all in cash. However, thieves broke into his house and took millions of dollars. I just got 150,000 followers on TikTok. No one asked. If you didn't ask, then why are you listening? What kind of boys do you like? I like boys with a clean shave. Hey, do you like me? I have a boyfriend. <laughs> Alright, first question. Are you the killer? No. Are you sure? Yes. Killer say what? What? Ha! We got him! Guilty! If a thousand kilograms equals a ton, what about three thousand kilograms? Oh, I know it, teacher! Okay, go on. Tan, tan, tan. At the end of this ruler, there's an idiot. I have a question. What? Which end? Are you okay? Help me! What happened to you? Call me an ambulance! Okay, thank you! Hey, an ambulance! What happened to you?
deadliest foods people actually eat. Fugu is one of the deadliest dishes out there. In Japan, people usually eat it as a test of bravery, because the toxin in the puffer fish can leave you paralyzed for the rest of your life. Ballad is a food in some Southeast Asian countries, such as the Philippines or Vietnam. People literally eat the duck egg fetus. In Asia, some cultures eat raw monkey brains. Rather than killing you, it could lead you with a severe infection. The brain of an infected monkey can transmit a disease that is uncurable. Kasu Marzu is one of Italy's most traditional cheeses. Despite its ban for causing side effects, to make it you set it outside uncovered and allow cheese flies to hatch eggs inside it. The eggs then hatch into maggots which eat away at your stomach. You're so short. And I'm glad that you're tall. Why? It gives me more of you to dislike. Dinner's ready. Okay, I'll be there in like 30 seconds. No, you're gonna turn it off and come eat right now. Five? Okay, okay. Mom, is dinner almost ready? Oh, shoot. We just finished eating. Sorry, I forgot to come and tell you that it was ready. Dinner's ready. Okay, I just need to finish this game, then I'll come. Of course, honey. You can come whenever you're ready. You know what? I'll bring you your food so you can continue playing. You Who are you? Time. You. you know Not me. I you. Yes, I am you. Mind. Are you deaf? You know no, you is blind. I'm not blind, you are blind! That's what I just said. <laughs> Luckiest people who survived the impossible. Satomi Yamaguchi is the only person recognized by the Japanese government to survive the atomic bombings of Hiroshima and Nagasaki. But unfortunately he died at the age of 93 after complications from the radiation which he was exposed to. Eric Nurse was scuba diving when he found a cave 10 meters deep, which he didn't realize was the mouth of a great white shark. His head, shoulder, and arm were caught by the animal. After a two minute struggle, Eric stabbed the shark in the eye several times with a knife and it eventually let him go. Roy Sullivan was a US park ranger who was struck by lightning seven times in survived. The first time he was struck in the foot, the second in his eyebrow, the third in his shoulder, and the fourth in the chest and stomach. Hello? Hey man, are you busy right now? Uh, kind of. Why? Well, I have something really important to tell you. What are you doing? I'm watching a live stream. Do you mind calling me back when it's over? Yeah, of course. Okay, I'll talk to you later. Bye. Bye. Stop taking pictures of yourself. Make me. I'm sorry, but your mom already made that mistake. I'm actually just trying to find my celebrity lookalike, see? What? How do I do that? Just click the link on my profile, then press celebrity lookalike and download it. <laughs> I got the same as you. <laughs> In a million coincidences, these two trucks lined up and said Taylor Swift. This guy took off the mask and looks more like Mario than Mario does himself. The mountains on the truck line up perfectly with the mountains in real life. These two ladies were dressed up almost the exact same and they're doing the same thing. This news reporter looks the exact same as the robber that's on the loose. What do you want to drink? Sorry, I have a boyfriend. I'm the waiter, stupid. Two flowers plus two flowers. Four flowers? Very good. Now it's 2,563 flowers plus 8,922 flowers. A garden? <gasps> Hello. Hi. Can I try drawing you in 10 seconds? Sure. All right. I just need you to count down from 10. And this isn't a joke. I'm actually going to try. All right. Ready? Yeah. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, Three, two, one. All right. Zero. Are you ready? Yes. Oh, thanks. You're welcome. Have a good day. You too. Thank you. Are you from Tennessee? No. Because you're the only ten I see. <laughs> I think there's something wrong with my eyes. Really? Why? I can't take them off you. Do you have a map? A map? Yeah. Why? Because I keep getting lost in your eyes. Okay, I'll give you that one. I wish I was cross-eyed. Why? So I could see you twice. <laughs> you know what you'd look good in? What? My arms. <laughs> that was good. Thank you. I thought happiness started with an H. It does. Mine starts with you. Oh. First name, Robin. Last name, the bank. So you're robbing the bank? You're such a nerd. All you do is study. You should be nice to nerd. Why? The chances are you'll end up working for one. When I 
I type in my computer password, it shows up as stars. What's the problem? Those are there to protect you, so if someone's standing behind you, they can't read your password. Yeah, but the stars show even when no one's standing behind me. Son, if you study today, I'll buy you an Xbox. Okay, Dad. I'm done. I lied. Me too. All these people on Instagram are rich. Do you want to know how to make lots of money on Instagram? Yeah, of course. It's really easy. Really? How? Please tell me. Go to your account settings, deactivate your account, and get a job. <gasps> how long has everyone here been married for? I've been married for almost 50 years. Wow, that's amazing. Perhaps you can take a few minutes to share with everyone how you stay married to the same woman for so long. Well, I try to treat her nice, buy her presents, take her on trips, and best of all, for our 25th anniversary, I took her to the Bahamas. Well, that's really beautiful and an inspiration to all of us. Maybe you could tell us what you're going to do for your 50th anniversary. Well, I'm thinking of going back to the Bahamas to pick her up. <gasps> Babe, am I pretty or ugly? Both. What do you mean? You're pretty ugly. <laughs> I made you some cereal for dinner. Hey, what do you say? Oh, uh, thank you, I guess. You guess? No, 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 I, 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 thank you, okay? Thank you. Yeah, that's what I thought. <sighs> Where's my food? Did I hear something? Huh, must have been a bug. Here you go, sweetie. This is disgusting. Oh, I'm so sorry, baby. What do you want me to make you? Um, can I have? You know what? Here's some money. Get in the car, we're going to McDonald's. I can't wait for school pictures. The only thing you'll see is your ugly pimple. Too bad you can't photoshop your ugly personality. That was Justin! Why is Justin's number on your burner phone? What's going on? I promise I'll explain everything when all of this is over. All of what is over? What are you involved in? And how do you know my boyfriend? We've literally been dating for two weeks. I know. I'm the one who made sure you two met. What does that even mean? Why? Because I needed someone to protect and watch out for you. Like a bodyguard? Who the heck are you? You'll understand. Right now you need to tell me where Herb is. I don't know! I'm currently freaking out that my mom set me up with a fake boyfriend. I'm sorry, honey. I need to find out the truth. Okay, I'm asking Herb myself. Ten minutes later. Honey, are you okay? Herb just showed me a picture. She sends the picture. Oh my god. Don't worry, honey. It's going to be okay. I've got this covered. And that's the end of the story. But if you want more just like that, then click the link on my profile to download the app. I want to break up with you. What? You'll never meet anyone else like me. Yeah, that's the whole point. Why did you hit my son? Because he called me fat. By slapping him, you think you'll lose weight? <laughs> Do you think you could come in on Sunday? I know you like your weekends off, but I really need you here. Yeah, of course. I'll probably be late, though, because public transport is a bit slow on the weekends. Ah, thank you so much. When do you think you'll be here? Monday? <gasps> Luckiest things found in storage units. A homeless couple looking for a couch bought a storage unit that had an old couch and a teddy bear for $10 because nobody else wanted it. But when they checked inside the bear, they found $300,000 in cash. A man from Long Island found a sports car in a storage unit that cost him $100. But that's not all. The car was from a James Bond movie and Elon Musk offered him $1 million for it. A couple who bought a storage unit found a 16th century pirate treasure chest. The chest was full of Spanish coins and the whole thing sold for $500,000. An art enthusiast bid $15,000 for some paintings to resell. Among the pile of 200 paintings, five of them were masterpieces that had been lost and they were worth $2.5 million. Unexplained photos that have finally been solved, part three. After seeing this skeleton, many people thought mermaids were real, but it turns out someone just photoshopped this picture. Many people are shocked that the dog is the same size as the horse and the picture is real. The owners just decided to enhance their dog. This picture shows two rainbows and a tornado. The Weather Network even aired this picture on live television, but later found out that it was just photoshopped. What happened? Why are you so sad? My girlfriend broke up with me. How come? It's all because of you. What? How? You told me to get her a chain for her birthday. Did you give her one with fake gold? No, I gave her a bicycle chain. <gasps> Do you want to be my partner? No, you're a loser. I may not be perfect, but at least I'm not you. If you see a coin in your car door handle, run and call the police. Thieves have found a sneaky new way to steal vehicles. They put a coin in your car door handle just like this, and if it's on the passenger side, you probably won't notice it. Then when you go to lock your car, it won't lock properly, leaving it unlocked for thieves. They can then follow you home, go inside it, and steal everything, including the car itself.
Here's the dark theory about Timmy Turner. In the show, when kids turn 13, they lose their fairy godparents. So fans believe right before he turned 13, he wished to be a ghost, which turned his whole world into the show Danny Phantom. This is why Timmy looks like Danny, Chester looks like Dash, AJ looks like Tucker, and Trixie looks like Paulina. Whoa, why is your nose swollen? I sniffed a bros. What? There isn't even a B in rose. There was in this one. Whoa. Families always wanted a ping pong table, but they could be really expensive and we don't want to spend that kind of money. So that's where this thing comes in handy. This portable net is way more affordable and convenient. You can literally bring it with you and play it wherever you want. If you want to get one for yourself, you can get it from the link in my profile. Now watch this. <laughs> Do you know which mouse can walk on two legs? No. Mickey Mouse. And which duck can walk on two legs? Donald Duck? No. Every duck can walk on two legs. If you could kiss me for free or the hottest girl in the world for a thousand dollars, who would you pick? No question, of course I'd pick you. What? Then who's the hottest girl in the world? I love you. I meant the letter U, not you. I love you too, but as a friend. <gasps> I'm sorry, but you suffer from a terminal illness and you only have 10 to live. 10 what? Years? Months? Weeks? Nine. What? Eight. <laughs> Yesterday I posted a TikTok about me posting a TikTok and getting a lot of comments about my teeth. You need to brush your teeth. Your teeth are so yellow. You need to go to the dentist. And I didn't expect the video to get 2 million views. It was just to promote my YouTube video. And lots of people aren't going to watch it. So I figured I'd make this video to show you guys what my teeth look like before. And after using Crest 3D whitening strips for 14 days, this is what they look like now. Hey, do you want to play a game? Sure, what game? Any game you want besides hide and seek. What? Why not? Because it's impossible to find a girl like you. <gasps> Dad, do you believe in ghosts? Of course not. Ghosts don't exist. But the maid said there's ghosts here. Son, pack your bags. Uh, why? We don't have a maid. So, are you gonna wear your new shoes today? Yeah, why else would I buy them? Oh, I don't know. Just try not to get them dirty on the first day. Yeah, yeah, whatever you say. So, how was school today? Good. Did you learn anything new? Oh, did anyone compliment you on your new shoes? No, Mom, nobody cares about my shoes. All right, so this is going to be your workspace right here. And is that the fire alarm? Yes, it is. We better get out of here. Oh, and you know the drill, right? Yeah. Hi, it's nice to see you again. Yeah, same to you. First name, Robin. Last name, DeBank. So you're Robin DeBank? What's your problem? I'm too smart for the first grade. My sister's in grade three, and I'm smarter than her too. Well then let's go see what the principal has to say. Okay. How about I give him a test, and if he fails just one question, he has to go back to class and be quiet. Okay, what's three times three? Nine. Six times six? Thirty-six. I see no reason why he can't go to the third grade. He answered all my questions right. Can I ask him some questions? Of course, go ahead. What does a cow have four of that I only have two of? Legs. What do you have in your pants that I don't have? Pockets. What does a dog do that a man steps into? Pants. What starts with F and ends with K? Fire truck. Put him in the sixth grade. I got the last four questions wrong myself. Uh. <gasps> I bought this lie detector, so if you lie, it'll beep. Okay? So, you were at school today, right? Yeah. Okay, okay, I was at the movies. Alright, I went for a beer with my friends. What? When I was your age, I never would have touched alcohol. <laughs> he really is your son. <laughs> what happened? Why are you crying? I was cheated on by my own dad. Tell me what happened. I needed money, so I told my dad to send me money for books. Then? He sent me the books! <laughs> Um, empty? Now what does it say? Empty. 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 Empty.
I'd like to buy some perfume for my wife's birthday. Okay, well, this one is our best seller. And how much is it? It's $50. That's a bit too much. Do you have anything cheaper? We have this one for $30. That's still too much. This one's $15. What I mean is I'd like to see something really cheap. Well, then here. <gasps> oh, you're the TikToker! You're the TikToker! You're the TikToker, aren't you? You're the TikToker! <laughs> Yeah, I can follow you, yeah. <laughs> I, my TikTok is, um, um, oh my god. Do the face, do the face. Oh, do you want to be um, in a TikTok? <laughs> yes, yes. Right. Bobs you didn't know existed. Ben Lashes is an internet famous cat manager. He manages famous cats like Grumpy Cat, Keyboard Cat, and Nyan Cat. He takes 20% of their earnings. So for an example, when Grumpy Cat made an estimated $1 million in her first year, he would have made $200,000 for just one client. Water slide testers travel from North America to places like Egypt to go to water parks and test their slides. They rate them based on the biggest splash and the adrenaline factor, then post their opinions online. Their yearly salary is $34,000. The China Giant Panda Protection and Research Center posted a job online called the Panda Nanny. You have to spend 365 days a year with a panda, but you get free meals and an SUV on top of the $32,000 salary. The only requirements are that you have to be 22 years or older and have basic knowledge of pandas. Hey officer, my wife is missing. She went out yesterday and she never came home. Okay, stay calm, sir. What's her height? <sighs> um, maybe like 5'5"? Five, five? No. 5'7"? Five, 5'6"? Seven, five, I'm not too sure. She's shorter than me. Okay, what's her weight? I have no clue. Um, she's not really slim, but she's not really big. What about her eye color? I think they're green. Wait, no, brown. Actually, I don't know. I, re I never really looked that close. What color's her hair? Uh, I'm not too sure. She just went to a new hairdresser, so it changed. Okay, what was she wearing when you last saw her? She was wearing a blue dress. Or were those jeans? Or maybe she was wearing shorts. I don't know. <sighs> Did she take a vehicle when she left? Yes, she took my vehicle. And would you happen to know the brand? Yes, it's a 2022 Black Sport Appearance 4 Ford F-150 Lariat 5 liter V8 engine with 400 horsepower and 400 torque stock. But I installed a 3 liter Whipple supercharger, so now it has 775 horsepower and 685 torque. It has the max trailer tow package, so it has a big 136 liter gas tank, black leather seats, power deployable running boards, twin moonroof, FX4 off-road package with skid plates, Bang & Olufsen unleashed 18 speakers sound system, 360 cameras, blue cruise so it could drive itself, power tailgate, 2000 watt generator built in the bed, 3.73 electric lock rear axle, upgrade all terrain tires, 20 inch 5 spoke, dark alloy wheels, and it also has a Borla Attack exhaust with black chrome tips, and unfortunately one of them has a dent in it from a rock. Don't worry sir, we'll find your vehicle. <laughs> Thank you. Knock knock. Who's there? Where when? Where when who? My place? Tomorrow? Me and you. You. Can I go to the bathroom? I don't know. Can you? When I was using can, I was using it as a secondary model from a verbal modifier asking for permission opposed to expressing ability. But I thought since you were a teacher, you would know that. <laughs> hey taxi, how much will it cost for you to drive me to the Super 8? Just $10. And how much for my bag? Oh, you don't have to pay for the bags. Okay, take my bag and I'll meet you there. <laughs> hey, I got married. Oh, that's good. No, that's bad. She's ugly. Oh, that's bad. No, that's good. She's rich. Oh, that's good. No, that's bad. She won't give me a cent. Oh, that's bad. No, that's good. She bought me a big house. Oh, that's good. No, that's bad. The house burnt down. Oh, that's bad. No, that's good. She was in it. I want you to be happy. Oh my god! You're a TikToker! What? How's it going? I follow you, dude! Yo, I follow you! How's it going? Oh, do the face, do the face. <laughs> what the heck? Can I tell you a joke? Yes. Yeah. Knock knock. Who's there? A little old lady. A little old lady who? I didn't know you could yodel. Oh. Oh. A little old lady. Are you gonna post this on TikTok? I don't know, can I? Please. Okay, maybe. I may I might, I might. Yeah, I'll be on I'll watch your account. Alright, you'll be on okay, the lookout. Bye. I love you. I love you too. Prove it. Tell the world that you love me. I love you. What? I said tell the world. You are my world. Where are you going? No. See, that always happens. I didn't like the first one, so I'm going to do a whole bunch of more takes until I get it. But I'm just going to show you guys the good takes so the video doesn't take forever. Because even though it's only like a 15, 30 second video, it takes a lot more time than, than you would think. Where are you going? No. Where are you going, sir? Nope. I have to get it perfect. This is why it takes forever. 
Where are you going, sir? That one was better. Go with that one. And then, like I said, I'm gonna film all of this character first so I don't have to keep taking off my hoodie. Doctor, I wanna lose weight. What should I do? Do you want my camera? What about my iPhone 12 Pro Max? Thinking like. What about my Lamborghini? What about a hundred million dollars? Congrats, you're skinny now! <gasps> Babe, what would you do if I broke up with you? Uh, I'd probably get back together with my ex. Now I see how much you care about me, we're done! What? We were supposed to go and watch a movie tonight. Go with your ex, but you are my ex. <gasps> Ouch. What's wrong? I've had a really bad pain in my neck all day. Oh, well I'm going to the store right now. Do you want me to get you something for your neck? Yeah, that would be great. Okay, what do you want me to get? A diamond necklace. <gasps> normal looking photos with disturbing backstories. This looks like a normal picture at first, but if you look on the left, you could see a hand around the girl that doesn't belong to any one of them. People believe this is the hand of a ghost because the picture was taken near a haunted house. This picture was taken in 1998, a few minutes before the red vehicle on the right had a bomb explode inside of it. Luckily, the father and son survived, but the person taking the picture didn't. In 1975, these two brothers took a picture because their hair was sticking up. A few seconds later, lightning struck and another hiker died. The boy survived, but one of them got a third degree burns and later took his life. Can I take a picture ben, of you? Four. So I can show Santa what I want for Christmas? <laughs> oh my god, why do you look like Pennywise? <laughs> Are you a photographer? No. Because I could picture us together. That was smooth. <laughs> can you help me? I'm lost. In my eyes. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I can No, help. I'm looking for directions to your heart, actually. Oh, <laughs> that was cute. <laughs> I use Pantene. What shampoo do you use? Marks. I use Dove soap. What about you? Marks. I use Olay lotion. What about you? Marks. Is Mark an international brand? No. Mark is my roommate. Mythical creatures people have seen in real life. For a long time, the giant squid was considered a mythical creature that whipped the boats of sailors. But thanks to the advance in science, in 2004, a giant squid was found in its natural habitat. In 1967, two explorers filmed the creature walking in a Californian forest, which to this day is suspected to be Bigfoot. The chupacabra is a mythical creature that supposedly sucks the blood out of cattle. But there's a farmer who claimed he killed it. Mermaids are described as enchanting creatures. It is said that through their singing, they attract sailors. Many claim to have taken pictures with them, all the way from Mexico and Jamaica to the coast of some African countries. Three most dangerous airplane landings. On a Myanmar Airlines flight in 2019, the plane lost its front wheel, so they were unable to land. The pilot had to do circles around the landing area to burn fuel so it would slow down the plane and make it easier to land. The plane landed with the rear wheels first, then the nose of the plane hit the ground. Everyone remembers Sully after his emergency landing on the Hudson River. Two geese collided with the engines of the plane to make them stop working, so the pilot had no choice but to try landing in the river, which he did successfully. At an airport in South Sudan, a plane carrying 43 people caught on fire after the wing collided with a car. What happened is the pilot couldn't see the runway because of the heavy fog, so he had to make a blind landing. But fortunately, all the passengers got off safely. Slow down! Slow down! You're going way too fast! I'm going 41 in a 40 zone. Do you see that stop sign up there? Yes, it's a long ways away though. Are you sure you see it? Yes, mom, I see it. Well, are you gonna slow down or what? Come on, use the right pedal! There we go, thank you! Mom, the light just turned red. Oh, thank you. <coughs> man was home alone when he heard on the news the description of a murderer that was on the loose. He looked through his glass window and seen a man standing there in the snow. He matched the profile of the murderer exactly and was smiling at him through the window. He immediately picked up his phone and dialed 911. He went back to the window and noticed the man was much closer now. He dropped his phone in shock when he noticed there was no footprints in the snow. Then he realized it was just his reflection the whole time. If you want more creepy stories like that, just download the app on my profile. I'm such a good sleeper. How do you know? I could do it with my eyes closed. Oh yeah? Well, I sleep better because I use this meditation app that increases focus, reduces stress, and makes you fall asleep faster. How do I get that? Click the link on my profile, then press meditation app, and download it. Can I borrow your phone to call my girlfriend? Your phone's a genius. When I... Your phone's a genius. When I put in her number, it showed up at... Oh. 
Your phone's a genius. When I put in her number, it said calling go girl. Your phone's a genius. When I put in her number, it said calling girlfriend. You're gonna pay a big fine for all those fish in your bucket. But officer, these are my pet fish. I bring them here to swim, and then they hop back in the bucket. Oh really? This I've got to see. If you can prove it, I'll let you go. Okay, let me put them in the water. So, where are the fish? What fish? I want you to be happy. Luke, what is the past participle of the verb to ring? What do you think it is, ma'am? I don't think. I know. I don't think I know either. Lucky <gasps> people who won the food lottery. This person found a mini orange inside of their big orange. This vending machine had an error and distributed everything for the price of one item. This person found a green pepper growing inside of a red pepper. This person got a carton full of double yolk eggs. Now before I tell you the craziest one about this bacon, I found this app that lets you prank your friends and family by changing their text messages. Just press this button on my profile if you want to try it too. This person ordered bacon from Five Guys, but since he was their last customer before closing, they gave him the rest of their bacon for free. Hello? Wrong number! <sighs> Hello? Okay, so that's one with cheese and one with pepperoni. You can pick it up in 20 minutes. Who was that? I don't know, but I took his order, so now we can sleep. <gasps> okay class, we're gonna start by sharing our dreams. What's yours, Luke? My dream is to earn a million dollars per year like my dad. Wow, your dad earns that much? No, that's also my dad's dream. <gasps> uh, excuse me, where's my table? Hi miss, uh, what's the name on the reservation? I don't need a reservation, I know the owner. I'm sorry, but we can't seat you unless you have a reservation. Are you serious? You're the worst waiter I've ever met, just let me in. I'm sorry, but I can't. You either have to wait two hours or make a reservation for another night. You know what? You're gonna regret this. I'm gonna show you that I know the owner. Hello? Hi sweetie, I need you to call the owner right now please. Okay. Hello? Real life glitches caught on camera. A guy pulled out a camera to take a picture of a bird when he seen this helicopter taking off. The helicopter starts flying but the propellers aren't even moving. A dad was recording his son while he was looking in the mirror. The boy turned around to look at the camera but his reflection in the mirror didn't follow his actions. In 1995 when Mike Tyson was boxing, there was somebody in the crowd recording on a phone. But the thing is, phones with cameras didn't come out until 5 years after this fight. And finally, these people were having a street race on the highway. As soon as the cars passed, you could see a dog in the middle of the highway. It would have been impossible to miss it so it had to have teleported. Who has trouble falling asleep at night? I'm so good at sleeping I could do it with my eyes closed. Wow, what about you Eric? I do have trouble but I'm thinking about decorating my bedroom to look like a classroom. If you guys really want to fall asleep faster, do what I do and use the app that's on my profile. Secret messages hidden in popular logos. In the FedEx logo there's an arrow in between the E and the X. It stands for moving forward, speed, and precision. In the Amazon logo there's an orange arrow that goes from A to Z. And this means they have you covered for every letter in the alphabet. In the Tostitos logo the two lowercase t's represent people holding a chip. And the I is a table holding a bowl of salsa. In the Hershey's Kisses logo, the space in between the K and the I is shaped as one of their chocolates. In the Pringles logo, the dot on the I is actually a chip. The B in this logo doesn't just represent beats, but also someone wearing a pair of headphones. This is the luckiest man alive. Frain Selleck was riding a train when it went off the tracks into a river. 17 passengers died, but he was able to swim to shore with nothing but a broken arm. The next year when he was on a plane, a door detached from the aircraft and it crashed. 19 people died, but Selleck was found in a haystack with a few bruises. In 1996, he was on a bus when it drove into a river. Four people died, but again he survived. In 1970, his car's fuel tank exploded on the highway. In 1973, his fuel tank leaked and his car caught on fire. Fast forward to 1995 and he was in a another bus crash. The next year when he was driving, a truck came barreling towards him. He jumped out of his vehicle and watched it explode. Babe, are you ready? Just wait, I have to do my makeup. You don't need makeup. Aw, really? You need plastic surgery. <laughs> Dad, I'm late for hockey practice. Can you please do my homework for me? Son, it just wouldn't be right. That's okay, you can at least give it a try, couldn't you? What kind of boyfriend are you looking for? A boy who doesn't drink or smoke, and he must wake up at 5 a.m. and go to sleep at 9 p.m. I know where you could find a boy like that. You do? Where? In jail. Where did you get that truck? I just bought it today. With what money? 
It only cost me $15. Who would sell a truck for that cheap? It was the lady down the street. She saw me riding my bike and asked if I wanted to buy her truck for $15. Oh my goodness, she must not be thinking right. You better go with him and see what's going on. Hi, I was wondering why you sold your truck to my son for $15. Well, two days ago I got a phone call from my husband's boss saying that he ran off to Hawaii with his secretary and doesn't intend on coming back. Oh my goodness, I'm so sorry, but what does that have to do with my son in your truck? Well, today my husband phoned to say his wallet was stolen. He said to sell his truck and send him all the money. So I did. Duh. I have the perfect son. Does he drink alcohol? Never. Does he ever come home late? Never. Really? Does he smoke? Never. I guess you really do have the perfect son. How old is he? He'll be six months old next week. <laughs> Why are you late? There was a man who lost a $100 bill. That's nice. Were you helping him look for it? No, I was standing on it. What?! Photos you're not supposed to see. Here's what the Teletubbies look like without their heads. Here's where the picture on the cliff bar was taken. Here's what a magic 8-ball really looks like. Here's what a ramen noodle cup looks like on the inside. And here's how pineapples are grown. <laughs> Why are you crying? I came here for a blood test. So? Are you afraid? No, for the blood test they cut my finger. Now why are you crying? I came for a urine test. <gasps> I want to surprise my girlfriend for Valentine's Day, so I got her these chocolates and a present, and now I'm going to invite her over. But first, I have to make my room look nice and romantic. So I opened up the Govi app and turned on all my lights. Then I went to the Govi light studio and picked out my favorite scene on the Valentine's Day page. Now that my room's all ready for her to come over, I opened up my messages to text her and realized I don't even have a girlfriend. If you can make me laugh, I'll PayPal you money. Go. Like, Yo, what oh. the heck? You better be joking. Stop. There's a ghost in your house. Don't just stand there. Run! There's a ghost! Run! Yeah, run! I'm not just gonna, like, get out of my house. Where am, where am I gonna go? I don't know. Anywhere but... Stop. Go, man! I cannot do this right now. I can, like... God, I never there, there's someone in the back. Like what the... <laughs> Yesterday I seen my girlfriend going into the movie theater with another guy. Did you go in after them? No. Why not? Because I already seen the movie. Kids who remember their past lives. Sam Taylor is a boy who was born shortly after his grandfather passed away. And in his first year he already had memories of his grandfather's life. He even said to his father, I remember when I used to change your diapers. When Sam's father was changing his. Shanae is a boy who was born with two birthmarks on his head. From the age of three he started having memories of his past life as a teacher. Who was killed by a gunshot to the head. James Leininger is a kid who started having nightmares at the age of two. About his past life as a World War II pilot. He claimed that in his past life he was the pilot James Houston. Who was shot down in action in the Pacific Ocean. Hey. I know you want me. Yeah, I want you to leave. Who here would like a $20 bill? I'm gonna give this $20 bill to one of you, but first let me do this. Who wants it? Well, what if I do this? Who wants it now? You've all learned a valuable lesson. No matter what I did with this money, it doesn't lose its value. It's still worth $20. Many times in life, we're crumpled, dropped, and ground into the dirt by the decisions we make. But no matter what happens, you'll never lose your value. You're special. Don't ever forget it. Sir, your x-ray showed a broken rib. What? Will I survive? Don't worry. We fixed it with Photoshop. So I heard you like bad boys, huh? Well, sometimes I go for them. Why? Well, one time the teacher said, raise your hand if you know the answer. I knew the answer, but I didn't raise my hand. <gasps> Look at this picture of my horses. Why did you cut off one's tail? I couldn't tell them apart. Stupid, can't you see the brown one's a bit taller than the black one? Bread, milk, chicken, rice. Can you put some peanut butter on the shopping list? Okay, I'll be right back. Why did you tell me to do this? Now I can't even read it. Huh? <gasps> My husband went missing. Okay, we'll be right there. Can you give us a description of your husband? He's six foot two inches, has blonde wavy hair, and always has a smile on his face. Thank you, we're just gonna verify this with your neighbor. You can't believe her. He's five foot four inches tall, bald, and always has a frown on his face. Why did you lie to us? Just because I reported him missing doesn't mean I want him back. <gasps> Every question I ask you that you don't know the answer to, you give me five dollars? 
and every question you ask me that I don't know the answer to, I'll give you $5,000. Okay. How many continents are there in the world? I'm not sure. My turn. What animal stands with two legs but sleeps with three legs? Ah. By the way, what was the answer to your question? Duh. What? So Trump said if TikTok doesn't sell its US operations by September 15th, he would ban it. And China says they would rather see TikTok in the US closed than have a forced sale. Who knows if it's real or not, but I just want to say thank you because I just hit 2.8 million followers today. And if TikTok does get banned, I'm going to post more on Instagram and YouTube. So make sure you guys go check it out by clicking this button. Are your parents bakers? No. Because you're a cutie pie. I'm just going to skip you now. Alright, see ya. If I could change the alphabet, I'd put you and I together. <laughs> Guess what my hoodie's made out of? Fabric. Boyfriend material. <laughs> <laughs> Were you born on the highway? No. Why? Because that's where most accidents happen. Dad, what's the difference between an Egyptian mummy and my mummy? It's simple, son. When we see an Egyptian mummy, you get scared. But when we see your mummy, I get scared. <gasps> Excuse me, sir. Is this bike for sale? Yes, it is. Would you like to purchase it? Mm. What's the lowest you'll go? What's the lowest I'll go? <sighs> Probably like two miles per hour. Anything slower and you'll tip over. Mom, we're going to be late for my soccer game. You know, your generation has no patience. When I was your age, if I was standing at the door like you are, my mom would be yelling at me that I'm not helping her with the dishes. Ah! Come on, you stupid computer! I don't have all day! I took my medicine at 6 o'clock today. Why? I told you to take them at 9. I know, but I wanted a surprise the bacteria. Yo, bro, Jimmy just got married too. So what? Bro, all of our friends are married and have jobs, and we're stuck here in the bar. We need to do something. I have an idea. What is it? Let's unfollow them. <gasps> Dumbest Things Bought by Billionaires Part 2 When a Hong Kong businessman inherited a 26 karat black diamond, he decided he wanted to keep it with him at all times. He got a craftsman to make him a custom iPhone 5 with a diamond mounted on the home button. The back of the phone is covered in 24 karat gold, the sides are layered with 653 white diamonds, and the screen is sapphire glass made with real sapphires bringing the total cost of the phone to 15 million dollars. I'm going to show you guys how you can add more movies and TV shows to your Netflix account. For example, if you're from America or Canada, you can't watch Doctor Who. But if you change your location to say United Kingdom, then refresh the Netflix app and search up Doctor Who again, it'll show up this time and you could watch it now. Before I show you how to get the app, make sure you hit the like button, then press share copy link so more people can see this. Then click this link on my profile and press Netflix hack to download the app. Guess what? The funniest thing happened today, and what were you going to say? I got a concussion. Did you actually? How? A flower pot fell from your apartment building this morning when I was coming to visit you and hit me on the head. What were you going to tell me? Oh, well I was going to tell you my mom's flower pot fell and hit someone on the head this morning. <gasps> I'm going to break my dad with this empty toilet paper roll. I'm just going to get it a little wet. Now I'm just going to crumple it up. Now I'm just going to set it right beside the toilet. So when he walks into the bathroom, this is what he sees. Now I just gotta wait until he gets home. He's just backing into the garage, now I just gotta wait until he goes to the bathroom. I'm just wondering why the door is closed. <laughs> oh my god. Luke, what does IDK and IDC mean? I don't know, and I don't care. Excuse me? Also, Mom, what's for dinner? I don't know, and I don't care. My doctor recommended that I exercise every day, so I've been playing tennis, cricket, and football daily. Nice, how long do you play for? Until the battery in my phone dies. And speaking of playing tennis on your phone, if you click this link on my profile, I've got this super fun tennis game that you guys can download for free. Hey, what are you doing? You can take whatever you want, I had a bad day. Okay, thanks. Wait, why are you letting me take things? So I have time to call the police. <laughs> hey mom, can I? No. I was just asking if I could. No. Hear me out, mom. I just want. No. <sighs> no. Fine. 
Hey, didn't I ask you to clean the house today? Well, I tried asking you if you wanted me to clean the dishes, but you said no. Then I tried asking you if you wanted me to back in the house, but you said no again. I even considered doing your laundry, but you just kept saying no. Oh. Can I please? Yes. Yes, you can. Okay, thanks. I'm going out with my friends. I'll be back at 1 a.m. Mom, I'm going to bring Bobby with me and we're going to go eat dinner, okay? All right, sounds good with me. Just make sure he takes care of you. Don't worry, Mommy. We'll be good. Come on, let's go. Have fun. So, what are we going to eat? Mm, do you want to order pizza slices? Sure, why not? It is Friday, after all. Hey, guys. What's for dinner? Oh, hey. Your brothers went out for dinner, so your dad and I decided to order pizzas for ourselves. Well, what about me? Hey Nathan, can you fix my computer? So what was wrong? It was an ID10T error. An ID10T error? What is that in case I have to fix it again? Haven't you heard of an ID10T error before? No. Write it down and I think you'll figure it out. Why don't you ever take me to some expensive place? Okay, get ready, we're going. <gasps> Where? To the gas station.